Hello guys and gals, this is Beauty Diva. I know I have been gone for a very long time. Um, had to take a little break from YouTube, take care of business, but now I am back and this is my first review after so, so, so many months. Um, before we get to the review, I want to thank everybody who subscribed during my absence. I am up to 67 subscribers. And two of my videos have made 1K views. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, my goal is to get to 100. And when we get to 100 subscribers, we're going to have a really nice giveaway. So like and subscribe to this channel. And um, click the notification button, the little bell. So you know when I upload a video, because I've had that people saying, I didn't know you had a video. I was checking my email. So click it, subscribe to the channel if you haven't been subscribed. Follow me on all my social media, which I will link below in the description box. And also comment. I always want your comments. If there's anything you would like me to review, talk about, please comment in the subscription. So, with further more to go, let's go into our review. And it's okay to make mistakes because we all try to be the best that we can be, money cannot buy. Okay, get it together, better act right. Everybody get together yelling black lives. And if you want to see a difference, open your eyes. They got me singing on the clouds falling from the sky. Can somebody help me? It feels like I'm falling now. I can't hold my Okay, so we are now going to be reviewing a very popular product that has recently come out in the drugstore. It's from Wet n Wild, and it is called the Wet n Wild Midnight Mermaid Collection. Um, it comes in a kit online for $35.00 which includes four eyeshadows, four, four liquid eyeshadows, three eyeliners, um, four liquid lipsticks, which we're going to talk about, and a um, highlighter, which is not here because I use it today. Um, today, I, I was thinking, how am I going to do this if I was going to like review the whole thing or do it piece by piece? So I actually decided to do it piece by piece. So today, I'm only going to review the liquid lip colors, which are four. Um, just to remind you, this is a limited edition collection from Wet n Wild. Um, in the past, for the summer, they did a unicorn one. And I think before that, they did like a Queen of Hearts. So for fall, they came out with the Midnight Mermaid collections, which is four liquid lipsticks, which look like this these are their very most famous um, cat suit but these have a little twist these are metallic so it's a metallic finish instead of a regular matte finish and these are very kind of non-conventional colors other than the than these two the other two are more non-conventional colors, which usually Wet n Wild doesn't come out with. It's usually other companies. So it's kind of a nice thing to have because you get the formula from Wet n Wild, which I absolutely love. You're getting metallic, which they've never made before, and you're getting these four really nice colors. So you can buy them as part of the kit or you can buy them separate individually. I think each one is $5 if I'm not mistaken. Um, I have tried their original um, catsuit liquid lipsticks and I love those. Very good formula. What I like most about um, Wet n Wild and I think I've talked about it in when I reviewed the Milani um, metallic cream lipsticks is the doe foot applicator on these is very unique. I haven't seen any other company make a doe foot applicator like this. It has like like little dip 
if you don't see that it's like a dip so actually this dip you're able to take the point of it and outline your lips like a lip liner and the rest of the doe foot applicator just hugs your lips so you get enough product on your lips so this is what i love about them all their liquid lipsticks are packaged the same um the actual packaging is really nice very compact um very sleek it fits in a lipstick container these fit very well in them because they're not too thick and they're not too thin and they're not too tall so i absolutely love the packaging um these from the midnight mermaid are really pretty it has the little seashe it has like little scales and there's a little mermaid here and it's all silver and it's very it looks very luxe it looks very high end very very pretty so um as for the actual liquid lipstick which i am wearing one today this is the color the one the color i'm wearing now is the color harbor a crush which is like a burgundy-ish color they're super comfortable i've already worn um coral cream yesterday and today i wore this one the harbor a crush they're both great formula and the other two are also great formula they are kiss proof very little has come on there and um they're very comfortable they're not drying to your lips i could wear these like every day and have no complaints um they come off pretty easy the only thing is the darker colors kind of stain so you really have to like go on a little longer to remove but they they generally come off really easy um, what I did notice between these and the Milani ones is that the Milani ones when they dry out they still have a good amount of metallic sheen to them which these I noticed especially the color Sirens Jewel which is like a greenish color they kind of dry out matte with like a little bit of shine but it's not like an overpowering metallic finish which I was surprised because I thought they were gonna be like the Milani ones that really just stay really metallic these don't do that so due to the fact that they don't do that I feel that this is really good to wear on a daytime basis they're not just for evening or special occasion. You could wear them every day. If you're not the person who likes to wear blue and green lipsticks, which I know many of you aren't, these two are really everyday colors. You can wear them, especially the, um, which one is this? The Harbor Crush. You can wear this with a nice smoky eye. This is gonna be really cute. Um, the coral crown for me when you're a deeper skin color this would look better with a like a dark lip liner I would not wear it alone but both colors I think are really wearable and I'm gonna show you lip swatches of all four colors mm -hmm. Falling now, I can't hold my ground, my ground. 
yeah, I've been falling for a long time. They got me sitting on the clouds, falling from the sky. While I'm looking in the mirror, who is that guy? It's gonna happen for a reason, I don't ask why. And me, I'm never giving up one last try. Every day I'm living up before I pass by. And every day I'm waking up, I gotta ask God. Watch over me, protect my life. Yeah, so when I spit it, telling no lies. Everybody be awake and they close eyes. And it's okay to make mistakes because... And I hope you enjoy this video. So I will be reviewing the highlighter. I will be reviewing the eyeliners and the eyeshadows. And I also will be doing a couple of makeup looks. Um, some for every day so you can see how you can wear it every day. And a couple of like holiday looks for like Halloween and for Christmas and New Year's. So I hope you loved my review and i am so happy to be back doing youtube videos and of course don't forget to like subscribe comment and follow me on all my social media because i do some extra stuff that i don't do on my youtube channel so you can get some like extra tidbits and don't forget when we get to 100 subscribers there's going to be a giveaway and they might be something from this collection in that giveaway. So, bye-bye and have a nice day. And until I see you again, take care.